Hey, ladies and gentlemen, buddy here, and welcome back to Banished The Forge Awakens mod from the Colonial Charter mod collection. And yes, we are resuming. Uh, I've just been playing a little bit. In other words, I've just like loaded the game. And yes, we were trying to build the bridge when Sibylline. Sibylai. How do you pronounce it? Fell off the ladder and killed herself. Fell off the ladder, no doubt, snapped her neck, and. Bye bye, see you later. So now we've got a new. Why have we got one, two? What? Why does that say two? Yeah. Okay, that's odd. Okay, whatever. Um, stop pausing it. Uh, so yeah, now we've... Uh, so, civil line's gone. So we've got to continue on now with only six people. Would be nice to have had the seven, but, you know, whatever. Uh, so we've got the... Uh, well, let's just have a quick, have a quick recap. We've got the gatherer's hut. We've got the honey cabin, which is good, because hopefully they are gathering some... more oh, bone meal, leather, venison. Nice. He's still got some roots. I didn't know they collected roots, so I would have thought that was more from the gatherers kind of thing to do, but, yeah. Maybe they just collected food and put it there? I don't know. Uh, storage barns there, got the tailor and the blacksmith. The tailor actually isn't doing anything because I was just about to put someone in there. Because uh, we're now actually on zero. Um, we actually don't have any stone either. Oh, God. This is not good. That's probably why that's not being built. Okay, so we better get some more... Stone. Have we got any more stone down here? Oh, yes, we do. Not much, but I've got a bit of stone, so we better go gather that. I might as well take the... Uh... Oh, no, the you, I, was gonna, I was about to say, I'll remove the builder, but no, 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 they're fine. Okay. Um, and the other thing I was also going to say, too, with this, uh, thank you for the uh, nice comments that I got in the last video. Thank you for welcoming me back. So, thank you very much to those of you who did, who did leave a comment. That was very nice. Um, so yes, I would definitely going to be making, um, more vids, more regularly. Um, so yes, and what else are we doing? I'm trying to think of something in this game that I was just about to mention, like, well, you've got it! Uh, oh, there we go, bridge has been built, finally got the stone. There we go, look at that. Um, can't be important because it's completely slipped in mind. But hey, look at this, now we can collect a heap of resources. Ah, oh, screw it, I'll just do this right there, like that. Right, there you go, people. Snag that. Snag all of that. Because we need it. We need it all! <laughs> Be a nice lot of stuff together. Um, what do we need to do? Well, the unfortunate thing with this game at the moment, because we're playing the Adam and Eve version, we're actually very, very limited on what, what we can do. Oh, I just remember what the other thing was. Um... Happiness of the people, I suppose, when someone dies, is going to... Um, what the fuck is that? Okay. Yeah, no, we've got to... Um, oh, I'm, I'm suffering from dementia or something. I think I've just lost it again. Yeah, no, I, I remember it there. No, it's... Uh, everyone knows to do these episodes now. I've done the first one, um, which was probably about around 50 minutes long, which is good. Um, I'm going to try and make each episode now around the 20-minute time frame. I think it's a sort of a comfortable time frame for people to sort of watch videos without being like too long or too short and you should get to see a fair amount of stuff happening. Um, I'm not sure with this one because as I was saying before being the uh, Adam and Eve version of the game because you only have two people it takes a lot longer to get started so you know we've got food source um, which is good and you know actually you know what I might actually drop someone out of that because we had whoops, I'll leave it on four. Drop the person out of that. We've got a heap of food at the moment. We've got fifteen hundred food. For only four you know, for essentially only six people. That's lots. Not gonna burn through that too too quick. Um But yeah, the thing is we're really, really limited on what we can really do at this point of time. Actually, I might just just for some shits and giggles, I might actually just get someone to do a little bit more of fuel. I know, I know they're not really even using it, but I'm actually going to increase it anyway. Just for a little bit, just so they can increase the amount. Just to get it up to... what's else? 
So this is our limits. Um, food, 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 food. Sorry, people. I've probably got the microphone too close. I think if, if actually people who who uh, watched my other video, if there was any like popping sounds, I think I actually had the microphone way too close to my mouth, and I was causing it to sort of you know with a p -p -p. whenever you say like P's or certain letters, kind of make that popping kind of sound. Yeah, and I do apologise. That was actually uh, me. Um, so fuel, it's on two hundred for now. I'm might just get it close to that. I don't think it's going to matter a great deal. So they're all gathering these. I mean, because slightly, the only slightly annoying thing is there's not really a great deal I can really do at this point until we get some more peoples. Um, I'm kind of tempted actually. I might just, I might even just chuck up another house. Just for now. I know there's no one's going to really sort of move into it just yet, but I'm going to have it there so it's ready to go. And kind of try and keep on top of it. I mean, you sort of average it for... Um, however many... Say, if you, obviously, in this case, we've got four adults. Therefore, you should at least have two houses. You know, for the two... You know, two people. Um, and the kids, well, they just mix in with the, with the family anyway. But each, fa each house should at least have two adults in it. Um, so, yeah. And of course with the gathering, I mean, I know I've just stopped the gathering, but you know, with the uh, Hunter's Cabin, they're still finding food. So, it's not too, too bad. And we have actually dropped the food a fair amount. Oh, we've got, we've got and, uh, oh, there we go. It just became a labourer. Beautiful. I can't even pronounce it. Hence, uh, Hensory, hens whatever. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and Tallington. Uh, what are you? Uh, dear, okay. So you just moved into there, did you? Okay. Right, that's fine. So that's fine. So now what? So it was actually good timing to get that built, actually. Snap. Look at that. Uh, so we've got that going. So what do we really need to do now? Oh, one thing I do need to do. Uh, uh, so what's the fuel? It's at 200. Uh, I might just let that go till it hits the limit, and then I'll just, you know, I'll just stop it. Narinda has been born. Hello, Narinda. Welcome to. Uh, what's that map? Oh. I can't think what the, uh, uh, what's the, uh, map, Refork, <laughs> good name for a, um, for a town, but anyway, I could change it, but I'm not going to, oh, see, it's up there, derp, idiot, wood on pie, you goose, uh, I'm just trying to think, what, what's the next best thing we should really be doing, oh, there you go, oh, see, I think about that, it's so hard to actually click on the one you want, don't need you, and I'm going to chuck someone in there for the tail. Let's just get some clothes made. So we should have leather now. It's not in there. Leather. I think 11. Hmm. I don't, I don't know how much leather you actually require, but, you know, whatever. At least it'll make some clothes. I mean, it's always good to have a few things. And see the tools, how quick that? I mean, not long before the end of the episode, I was at 47, and it's already down to 29. I don't want to close that. Um, yeah. So you dro it drops pretty quick. It drops pretty damn quick. Uh, something to do, I suppose. I might chuck in. Oop. I always got this fascination with actually doing the roads, or all the house with at least a road around it. I don't know why, but I always just do. I just think it looks neat, puts them on their own little block, essentially. <laughs> okay. Okay, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? So we've got some peoples now, we've got three labourers. Wow, they cleared that out pretty quick, didn't they? 
So we need to... I might just chuck one person back into the gatherer's hut. Just, you know, because. What are you short of? Oh, leather. Do I want to chuck someone else into that? Just to help. I might just chuck some one more person in. I did do that right way around. Yes, I did. That's okay. Um, again, just keeping the things flowing here. I'm just going to chuck in one more house right there. Oops, click on the right thing. Get that road going. Um, they're bashing through that stuff real super quick. That is going up lightning fast. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, okay, well, food is obviously always a good thing, but you know, we've got a reasonable amount of food and stuff going at this point of time, so it's not a big deal. Uh, how much I on? Is that all got none? Oh, mm, yeah, that's what I was thinking of doing. Because I actually don't, that's the amount of stored iron. All I've got at the moment is iron ore. Uh, okay, because I've got heaps of iron ore. Now, because we cleared out all of that. Um, nope. Iron. Doo -doo. It's less efficient than the large foundry or the forge buildings. That's the big. Don't do that. Metalsmith. Wow. Not that I can actually make that because it needs wooden planks. It's a good starter though. Uh... Yeah, screw it. I'm going to get it done. And I will remove some of those tree they shall just grab it all. Screw it, I don't care. Need to keep need to keep this stuff clear anyway. Bye bye trees. Reserve of stone is low. Dang it is too. I don't want to clear too much because I also want to keep them, you know, vaguely happy. Whoa, that's a lot of stone just there. That's nice. Uh, okay. I might just quickly pause that. Because we're just passing around the 13 minute mark. So we're keeping an eye on that. Uh, but what do I need to do? I need... Uh, this, is so, this is really tricky trying to know what to actually do and... Oh, we've got another child. Buella? Bula? <laughs> oh man, I'd love to know how they come up with these names for, this, uh, for the uh, kids in this game, it's funny. Um, oh. It's hard to know sort of what to do next. I mean, when you look down the list, there's so much stuff you could be doing. It's literally insane. It's like, where do I take it from here? Uh, a very slow method of creating lumber. Oh, okay. So you can actually create a nice simple way of creating lumber, or you can have the sawmill. Which actually takes a lot of logs. Which Oh, that's cool. Uh, use the flattened terrain tool if you remove this building. Oh, okay. Not quite sure why you have to, but hey, I'm not going to question. Mm. I might chuck it right there. Yeah. Excellent. At least we'll be able to make some lumber, which is really cool. Okay, I know it's probably fairly inefficient at this point of time, but we don't have a great deal of people to be able to do everything, so you're going to play it slow. Uh, 
I need some more stoon. That might get built first, actually, but that's fine. Looks like I'm going to need to have another house in a minute, so... Boop, get rid of that. I might get a house on the end there. Ugh, not quite. I could just do that. Or, actually, I can... Um, where's the... Here's the flattened terrain tool. There we go. <laughs> I gotta admit, I gotta admit, I love that little tool. And I'll go away for them to do that. I think. Do I? Oh no, I don't. I've just got to go. No. No, don't do that. Move roads. Uh, do that very carefully as you cannot undo your actions. Oh, hang on. Um, no, I thought it was cancel removal. No, it's not that, obviously. Remove structure. Yeah, there we go. It's probably still not enough to do the house, but, you know, I'll look at that. Yes, it is. Because actually, yeah, flat, flattening it down actually makes it a structure. So, okay. I, just, I now remember. I'll put that there just so there's a bit of road. Because we should be getting close to have, being able to have another place here, so. Yeah, baby. So I'm just going to have to. Now we're going for tools. It's still okay for the moment. There's the saw pit. Love it. That is actually quite sexy. Uh, da, da, da. So that comes under materials. It comes under iron. Oh, I see. Oh, it indents the ground. Right, that's why you got to use the flatten tool. Okay. That's kind of cool. Learning things every day, ladies and gentlemen. Because, <laughs> this again, there's so many changes. You just have no choice. That looks really neat, actually. Look at that. I probably should have left a gap there. It would have probably looked a bit better, but anyway. Uh, what have we got? I might just drop... Oh, hang on. Nope, I'm sorry. Good way for the house to be built. Now I'm going to drop the... Builder off. And I might just chuck a... Worker into there for now. Look at that. Oh, right, you've actually already exceeded your, uh... So what have we got that's stored that's classified as that? I'm not entirely sure. Okay, doesn't matter. I'm not yet. Uh, what have I got that's... I don't know. My duck meat. No idea. It's kind of the only thing that sort of annoys me. It's like it's pretty hard to tell what maybe the iron ore and the f no, it's not firewood. Firewood's that. Could be the iron ore. It's classified as a material rather than it must be. And I might even drop you. Yeah, I'll drop you out for now. Look at that. Going for it. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, have we got anyone in there yet? No, because they haven't actually grown up yet. These kids have not grown up. Tallington is even by himself. And you've only got a couple of young'uns, so you don't count. Yeah, they're getting there. They're closing on the gap. And the Steve, well, yeah, well... His wife passed away. She fell off a ladder and broke her neck. <laughs> what can you do? So wait f until... Oh, there's another kid. Lan. Went to a party. Uh, went to a land party. Uh -huh. 
That's not even funny. Okay. Well, since you're probably not really doing a great deal, I might as well get you just to... Is there any stone down there? There's a bit of stone, a bit of iron. Food is still pretty damn good. It's almost elite food, but not quite. And we have actually now passed the 20 minute mark. So, ladies and gentlemen, and that's how long these episodes are going to go for. So, on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I know probably not a great deal happened. But, we will call it quits on that note. Um... I might actually just play, I'm, I'm actually, between this one and the next episode, I'm actually going to keep playing a little bit just offline, just to, uh, you know, maybe just to get things rolling a bit, a bit quicker, because, you know, this is getting a little bit slow and probably a bit tedious, and I don't think you guys want to keep watching literally nothing happen, apart from building a few houses and a couple of other things, we didn't do a great deal. So, yeah, I might just play a little bit offline and then just, you know, see what, and then take it from there. You know, ladies and gentlemen, that's it. Um, hope you enjoyed the episode, and don't forget to leave plenty of comments and loving and all that cool, awesome stuff. Uh, yeah, hit the like button, subscribe, all that cool. Yeah. You know. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's it. Um, till next time, till episode three, keep cool, keep safe, and I'll catch you around. Goodbye.